the hecky. You better stop chopping down heaven's flagpoles. Dad's gonna flip. Right oh, Jesus, it's fun. They grow straight back, and what God doesn't know won't hurt him. God knows everything. God knows everything. Dad, Honey Hickey won't listen to me. Jesus, sure he's a great Maori leader. Oh, kia ora, bae. But you're my main man, my two I see, my only begotten son. Now try again. Honey Hickey? I... D- Dad said... Stuff th- off! I don't have to listen to you. It's part of my culture. Christ, you're annoying. Dad said... Jesus. Watch this and learn a few things about Tangata Whenua, or people of the land. Then there's Hone, Hiramia, Hoane, Horo, Haki, Rangi, Boy. Oh, uh, yeah. I've got heaps of male cousins. How come you ask, Al? Oh, kia ora for asking, Jeff. I marvel at the Māori and their extended Fano or family. So virile. Don't be a hungry pants, Miss Grey. Sorry. It's just that I've been looking forward to hearing about your fucker, papa, or genealogy for so long. This sucks! First time we go on a class trip and it's to Jeff's cousins in the country. So they will be learning about Maori culture. So? What's so different about the ones that live across the road from us? Maoris are Maoris. Yeah, the country ones speak better Maori, have bigger lips and less teeth missing. Oh, yuck! I'm not gonna pass any of them. You bloody sit kids better not come back with tattoos that look like you fell asleep on the oven. They're very special to the wearer, Dad, and the Maori word is moko. Hey, you want me to moko your mouth? Yeah, I can teach you about the Maori culture. I learned it in prison. Really, Dad? Yeah, I was top dogs, man. Top dogs. Yeah, you just show people your tongue when you like them like this. And, and your bum when you hate them like this, yeah? That's bloody Maoris! Don't be racial, Dad! You know, I'm only letting you go so I can watch my pornos in peace, you know? <laughs> what if one of Jeff the Maori's relatives tries to rob me? I'm the only senior. It will be very dangerous, Miss Grey. Used, get on the bus. You can get your Glock from the lost property at the end of term. Ah, this country is full of savages. Yeah, you've been carjacked by the Mac. Thanks for the matching luggage. I'm sure you're insured, Whitey. Bye, son. Bye, Rodney. Hey, fellas. Son, don't touch yourself when you get there. God's everywhere, even with the Maoris. Agnes! God loves everybody. I better give you extra punishment after prayers tonight. Tiger! Shame, Mum, that's just gross. Then shut your mouth or I'll cut off your head in front of everybody. And Reverend Minister Pleasel. Oh, oh, well, I, I suppose I do deserve to be struck by your bolt of lightning. <laughs> hey, Agnes! He over here! <coughs> hey, Apu! Shut your lips, Jeff! Yeah, we'll hear that song enough times when we get there. Oh, relax, fellas. My Auntie Queenie organised a trip for us. Oh, you'll love her, bro. She's always been my favourite auntie. Auntie, how come I have to move to the city with my mum and my eight dads? Better TV reception, boy. And we don't have any more land for you to play on. How come? The bloody thieving colonialists stole it all. Can you say that, boy? Bloody thieving colonialists. Bloody... Nah, it's too long, Al. That's all right, boy. Just call them Pakehas. My cousin Cliff Curtis will be there too. Oh, he's a Maori actor in Hollywood. He hangs with all the Flash people all the time, but he talks just like a bro bro. Oh, he's choice. And he gets to act as Latin American drug dealers and terrorists and Iraqi refugees. Well, Uncle Bully for you. And my auntie's the best cook. Oh, she makes the meanest kai. Or food. 
I hope she uses canola oil. Oh, she'll cook us a choice feed of pork bones and puha and mutton flaps and fry bread. Jeff, it's precisely those fatty elements in diets that cause disproportionately high numbers of Polynesians to die from diabetes and obesity-related illnesses. Shut up, Vale. At least we get some food. Oh, yeah. Yay! Food, 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 food. food, food. Let's take our minds off our hunger with a nice song. Didn't we have a lovely time the day we went to Bangor? We're here! Hey! Already! Already! Kiora Bay! Well, Tommy Kangaroo Down spot is beautiful! It's right next to the dump. Before the council made it a dump, it was a sacred burial ground. Jeff, I thought you were from up north like all the other Marys. Yeah? North Morningside. Oh, don't worry, Al. Auntie Queenie's gonna take care of us. Yippee! I'm home! Hi, Auntie Destiny. Hi, Cousin Keisha. Hey, Cuz, where's Auntie Queenie? She died of diabetes. <laughs> Jeff, we know you're upset, but where's the food? Who will cook our kai? You've got to think, man. Oh, we're we're starving. Starving. I'm Valer, but you can call me later. Pow pow. I love you, Keisha. My auntie just died. And I'm here for you, girl. I love a good tangi or funeral or cry. Come on, boys. We can't go onto the marae until we've had an official pōwhiri. Or welcome. Get ready to speak on behalf of your group. I don't know how, Al. Someone has to speak. I'm too shy, Al. There's no need to be fucker, ma, or embarrassed. You can do it, Jeff, and then we have to sing a waiata or song. Song? Okay, since Jeff's too upset, I'll speak. Hide him I, hide him I, hide you guys. Tea hay is what tick cows eat. Tenakoto, tenakoto, and again I say rejoice. Call Mac, takawe ingwa, a ho. Call St. Sylvester's, call school. Call mean streets of Morningside, taku turanga wai wai, tato tato e. Call hanga reo. To the people who live here, we say, Kia ora. No my, oh my, apple pie would be nice right now, but keep cool till after school. And then, ow, my tongue. Ko waiata ano? I believe the children are the future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. Show them all the beauty they possess inside. Yes, yes. Thank you. All right, come in. You're welcome. We we can hongi now. Hey, Keisha, want to be my hongi bun? You were the choicest auntie in the world, Al. <laughs> Say hi to Bob Marley. And Tupac and Biggie. Oh, yeah, so that's Bob Marley, Tupac and Biggie. And our mum. Bob Marley, Tupac and Biggie, Valley Valier's mum. And Barry White. B- du- Bob Marley, Tupac, B- B- Barry White, B- B- Cousin Cliff, bro. Get away from me with that common Maori street lingo. I have just flown straight in from the set of Pablo's Revenge. Now, Auntie Queenie's... Gone. Dead. The tribe can finally make some decent cash. Observe. Some fine upstanding Japanese investors want to redevelop our tribal land into a mall. (gasps) Since we're between the dump and the poo plant, that's a pretty good deal. Auntie wanted us to safeguard our assets for the future generations. Shut up, kid. You're always speaking out of turn. The future generations can have jobs in the food hall. All those in favour, raise your hands. You have to do something, Jeff. This is the will auntie wrote. She wants you to decide what happens to the land from now. Hey, oh, don't ask me. I don't know what to do with it all. Watch it, Jeff. Those Aussies took me land, took me cousins away. Bloody stupid prime minister still isn't said sorry. Bloody bumbadoo. 
You can do it, bro. For your people. For Frodo. And for your Auntie Queenie. Stop the news, man. Auntie Queenie will be rolling in her grave if she could hear this. Huh? But of course she's not in her grave because she's over there in her open casket. That is our custom. Who the hell are you? That's, That's our bro, Jeff the Murray. You Marys. And Auntie's will says he and he alone has the final say on the land. He's not a leader. Yes, yes he is. is. The Japanese businessmen will be here in two days. They're offering millions. What can you offer, Jeff? Oh, uh, um, Polly? Yeah, J Jeff the Maori would like to accept the mantle of leadership and he'll get back to you tomorrow. Boys, I'll be discussing sovereignty or tēnā tanga issues with the men. Uh, I've never heard of anything so barbaric. Communal sleeping. No wonder their birth rate is so high. And you flick your wrist like that. Wow, it makes your joints so supple. Hey, girl, your daddy's here. Kiss, kiss. Get lost, Valaya. Don't fight it, Keisha. It's bigger than both of us. Mm. Ow! Oh, that's good. I wonder. For sure. Hey, fellas. Don't use the toilet for a while, eh? I just dropped the kids off at the pool. Hey, everyone! Keisha was just trying to bash me, but I told her, Hey, girl, just my best mate. Oh, I'm sweet, bro. Oh, but don't ask her that way, because she'll just deny it. I just can't believe how come Cliff's like that. He's normally sweet as hell. Hey, I think I'm just going outside for a think. This leadership stuff's sore for my head. What are you looking at? Give it up, boy. I'm all as the best thing for this dump. You've changed, bro. It's Hollywood, eh? I'm just a realist, Jeff. The best thing you can do for your auntie is sign the damn papers. Sign them! Get lost now! Ow, ow, ow! <laughs> Whoa, whoa, what sad guys? <laughs> no, what a madness, Jeff. You were scared to piss yourself off. Oh, no, oh, not even, not even. What's that? What's... It's a ah! Hey, what's wrong, old man? My name is Koro. I'm crying out for the land. Papa Tuanuku, the Earth Mother, weeps, and I weep with her. Oh, but I'm in charge. I just gotta convince the tribe there's a better way. Your auntie's great wish was to keep the land safe for when the whales come back. The whales? The whales? Our, our ancestor, Pied Pai Kakariki, called to Kiora Bay with his magic flute. Aye, Tama. The very same ones. Oh, that's a myth, Al. Listen to me, boy. Listen. <coughs> Listen to me. The whales will come. But only if you believe. And when she looked back, the axe murderer was on the car roof, smashing her boyfriend's head. Ah, shut up, Fale! I'm not scared. Yes, you are. Hey, no? hey Fallis, what whales will come to Morningside to swim in poo? Um, the real poo whales? <laughs> <laughs> Stop you, man! I believe that old man, and I know that tomorrow the tribe will believe too. I know where Maori's Jeff, but how do you expect us to believe that mumbo jumbo? I believe him. I believe in you, Keisha. Are we going to put our future in the hands of a snot nosed little kid? I haven't got a snot nose. <laughs> Stuff you. I'm going to bring the whales. And I won't just get one. I'll get three, four, five. And I'll, I'm going to bring 15 whales. What am I going to do, Coral? Everyone thinks I'm mental, Al. The ancient nose flute of Pied Paikakariki. <gasps> 
It has been passed secretly from generation to generation until it went missing a few years ago. And then everyone forgot where the secret place was. Stand on the shore and play when Ra is at its highest. Believe and they will come. It's our last chance. So what were you saying, Nikki? So like I see whales, I see water, lots of sand. Sequel's mm. going to be called Once for Whale Riders. Oh, how witty. Kia ora. I thought so. Sorry, Jeff. Um, believe, and they will come. Go on, bub. My name is Jeff Damari. And I am the son of my mum and my eight dads. I come from a long line of proud pot-smoking doll bludgers who were also really good singers. My auntie said I have to decide what to do with the tribal land. It's not anyone's fault, it's just what happened. Maybe I can't speak Maori. And maybe I get my fish from the takeaway with the dollars through the chips. But I'm still a Maori. Behold, the ancient bone nose flute of Pai Pai Kakariki! <gasps> What's wrong? Oh, the, the, the flute's blocked up our some sort of dried green substance. Enough! Mamba, Jumba, mystical Maori crap! <clears throat> it's time to sign the deal. Stop crying, man! Here. Jeff, look, it's your guitar. That always makes you feel better. <laughs> it's the little things that bring me down. It's the little things that bring me down. Okay, Jeff, we get the point. You're upset. <laughs> hey, what the... Are those what I think they are? It is! I thought so! Giant poos! They're sperm whales, you dick! Look, the sperm whales are coming! <laughs> he said, the sperm whales are coming! <laughs> <laughs> what the? See, Cliff? The whales are back. And look, the tourists are already coming. God. She said, the tourists are already coming too! <laughs> You bought the whales, cuz. No, you bought the whales, cuz. See, Cliff, cuz, the whales are here. We don't need a stink wall now. Ah, uh, cuz, that's not your cousin, Cliff, cuz. What the? A Japanese investor! Aye! I would have gotten away with it too if it hadn't been for you, meddling kids! Hey, you can take your mall and stuff off, okay? Maybe we can still work together. Something smaller that uses the wheels but makes you a whole lot of money. Uh, we'll have a hui. Or meeting. I can't be leader, cuz, cuz I have to go back to school. But maybe you can stay and help sort out stuff and make someone older leader. Nah, cuz. I've been casting a movie as a Maori, cuz. Oh, stink. Just kidding, cuz. Of course I'll stay and help, cuz. Oh, kiara bay. Come, mote way. Or. Awesome. awesome! Some days I just love my work. Or mahi. Hey, Keisha, you could have been the Valer rider, you know. But if you ever want to get pregnant to a thug life hard out guy who's always going out with his friends and leaving you at home, you call me, eh? 0800 Love Dog. I love you, girl. Pew, pew. Sorry, Valer. Us Mori women have to preserve our childbearing properties. Later, Zal. Later, Zal. Jeff, I got this choice idea, cuz. What do you reckon we build a drama school to teach Maori actors how to play other ethnic minorities in Hollywood movies? Sharp, sure, bro. Hey, can you say goodbye to old man Koro for me? Hey, old man Koro? Cuz, he's been dead since last century. Man, that was the awesomest class trip. Kia ora, Jeff, bro. Kia ora, Jeff, bro. Kia ora, boys. What's the time? What's the time?
Sorry, I got smart before Jesus. I should respect that there's different types of leaders. I should have respected your right to chop down flagpoles, Honeheke. Well done, Koro. Oh, I couldn't have done it without Jeff. But it was the wrong Jeff, boy. I met that other Jeff, the Rhodes Scholar. Why would I pick that Jeff? He's just a snot-nosed little boy. Oh, sorry, Queenie. Blame it on the glue here as a child and the poor standard of health care available to Maori. Tell me, Auntie Queenie, what is the most important thing in life? It is the people. Uh, the what? The people. Uh, what's that you say? The people had tangata. I had glue here, remember? Listen to me, I said the people had tangata, you stupid. How about a song, eh? Ah, oh, cheer, God. I miss Aotearoa, but heaven's pretty choice, too. Tu fela mai na iwi, awe, tato, tato, we. Oi, you coming back with me? Hold on to your dicks. Ah, uh, Iri, Iri Wang, uh, far Maui's heart, eh? Uh, thanks New Zealand on air and TV free. Shout out.